package from I Heart Revolution. It is so big, and you guys probably saw the teaser on my Instagram from the barcode. And I Heart Revolution sent us a huge package of some of um, their makeup. And they also left a note on the top, so let's go ahead and open this bad book. Okay, so I'm gonna read this real quick, and it's I Heart Revolution. So it says, hi, she sisters. We have watched your makeup video on your channel, and I've chosen yours for our sponsor to get get more word out, out about our cookie palettes. That came out not too long, long ago. We also have Halloween palettes that we might possibly send send you to sponsor when they come out. So I'm looking forward to seeing the video. I Heart Revolution Co. So that's the little note they wrote that came on top of the box. So let's go ahead and open it. I'm so excited. And we got we got that pack we got this package on Thursday because it says when it arrived. It arrived Thursday, September 9th at 7.13 p.m. So we've literally been waiting two days to unbox this with you guys. Because on Thursday we kind of didn't have it. So it has a little bag inside. So this is the bag. And now we're gonna open it. Let's see the flavors that we got. <gasps> So the first one we got was the red velvet. Wait, what does it say? Red velvet. So it's a squishy and it's so cute. So this oh is the first gosh. one we got. And then the second one we got was the chocolate chip. Um, that one is so cute. It has the shade right here. And I'll show you this when we get into the bathroom. And then the last one we got was the um, triple chocolate which this one has a little bit of harder squishy since it's like triple chocolate. They sent us three out of the four palettes. And then the next one we're gonna get is the Halloween and the birth cake. Birthday cake is and the then last one they gave the us two additional brushes. So we can use these, I guess. And now let's transfer to the, the, sp the sponsors. Thank you so much, I Heart Revolution, for sending us these amazing cookie palettes. Each palette has a unique color and shimmer to your liking. Thank you again, I Heart Radio, for sponsoring this video, and stay tuned for their Halloween so we're palettes. We're only going to be testing out the chocolate chip in today's video, but if you guys like it so much, I'm going to do an Instagram poll later today, so comment it. Um, one, if you like the, if you watch the video, and if you like it, and we will do... Um, we will test out the red velvet and the triple chocolate. Okay guys, so first I'm going to be starting out with this brush. So I'm going to use this naturally color, like this natural brown right there. I'll show them. This is what she's got. This? Yeah, that one. Right no, here. not that one. This like, yeah. like light cocoa brown. There's like a light cocoa. No, so there's no names for the is this. And if you guys like all these videos so much, maybe you will try the Fruity Pebbles and the Coca ones if they still have them. Which they probably don't because we're in, yeah, whatever. Okay, so let's start. I'm just going to get a little yeah, bit on I'm going to follow behind Nyla just because that's what she's doing, so I have to do it as well. Alright, that should be good. Now we're going to just do it on one eye because it's a little bit easier and not wasting as much. So we're going to start blending it like right on my eyelid. And we're just blending it. And I just did the bottom of my eyelid. It's really natural. It actually blends really well into my skin. Okay, guys. So I'm done, and you can't really see it, which this would be a nice natural look. So I did. I did. Brush. I did this eye. 
Yeah, and if you guys did not see our last video where we made the setting spray slash makeup um, cleaner, you guys should go watch it. It's a great formula that I think you guys should try. Keep that. And then Nyla show them what you look like. Okay, not really guys. much. So I did this eye and you can't really see it. It's really blended in there good and it's a really good natural color. So yeah. Okay. So I'm gonna pick the next color that we're gonna be doing on this eye. And I think that we're gonna go in with, um, I'm gonna go in with this like flat brush. And we're gonna go in with, now you can't look, so turn around. All right, are you ready to see the color that I picked? Yep. We're gonna go with this olive shimmer right here. So I get to use it first. Okay, so I'm gonna use the brush that Kata used last time, kind of like a flat brush, brush, brush. And I'm not gonna get that much because Kata got a lot. So yeah, I did not mean to get that much. Just a dab, and look how much you get on a dab. Like, that's a lot. I did not mean to get that much. <laughs> okay. So, so I'm gonna put this like kind of where I put my brown. And it kind of gives me like smoky eye vibes. I'm gonna kind of just blend this into my brown. And kind of under my eye. That shimmer is really good. It doesn't look that bad, actually. I'm not getting much of the green on my eye. Did you try to add more? Yeah. But that that actually looks good. This is what it looks like. I don't. I can't get like that's what it looks like. That shimmer is. And I kind of just did it all the way over my eyelid. Honestly, that doesn't look bad. I need some more under the eye. That doesn't look bad, guys. Nyla is still applying to hers. How's it going there? It's going good. And then we're gonna rate the colors. So that first like cocoa brown. Okay, so guys, this is what mine looks like. It actually blended pretty well. I didn't think it was gonna blend that well. Kylie kind of did an ombre on hers, but I kind of blended mine in. So, so the cocoa brown, I'm gonna rate that a 10 out of 10 because honestly, that's like, if you're going to dinner or on a date, it would look really, really good, you know, pop in. This um, like shimmer green, I, it looks really good. I did think that it would actually capture, but I'll give it a eight out of 10. Now okay, the rate next the, one. Rate the cocoa brown. Uh, the cocoa brown, I'll give it a 10 out of 10. It's a nice natural look. The shimmer, I'll give it a six out of 10. It didn't blend as well as I wanted it to, but the next color we're gonna be using because it's shimmer. So, Kai, are you ready to see the colors that we're using? Yes. We're using this brownish orange color. Okay. So, I'm going to. So, use... I think we're going to do three colors on one eye and three colors on the other eye. So, these are the colors that we're using with the cocoa brown, the shimmer green, and the orange. So, I'm using this flat little. It's like an uh, angle. It's an angle brush. Yeah. So. So, you're going to put that in like your highlighting creases? Yeah. Up there, I think I'm going to use um, one of the new brushes, and this is one of the ones that you would apply um, eyeshadow with. And I think I'm just gonna put this up on my brow bone. I'm 
kind of just applying it. And yeah. Ooh. That was nice. See that, guys? Honestly, my eye looks pretty good. <laughs> Y'all can see right there. Hey, but that actually looks really, really good. Guys, I, I like think it. I added a little bit too much green on mine, but this is look what right here. Oh, this is what mine looks like. No, oh, right there. This is what mine looks like. It's not the best, but it's okay. All right. So, what do you rate that brown? This brown, I think, would be really good, but it doesn't blend well with the green, so. We're cleaning our brushes as we go. So I recommend doing that because our colors probably blend. Yeah, what they will blend is if you do not spray them a little. Okay, okay guys. So, so I get to pick the next color and we're going to start. Oh, I didn't rate this. Um, So that like orangey brown, I would honestly rate that a 9 out of 10. I love how it goes with the green. It goes with the green really good. Um. So I'm gonna choose the next color. So now if you could turn around while you're cleaning that brush. Um, okay, let's see. For the next eye, I think we're gonna go with this color here. Okay, are you ready? Yep. What color are we using for the second eye? We're gonna use this dark mocha-ish. Ooh, I like that color. So we're gonna use, it's kind of like the color of this cookie. So, now the color what brush you're going in with. I'm not going to use this brush because I don't want to use too much of that. So, I'm going to use the brush I did the last round, I think. So, it was kind of like a flat brush. And I'm going to go in with that, like, right around, like, here. I'm also going to go in with a flat brush. And these actually have, this palette has really good pigments in it. I'm very surprised. I think I'm gonna go in with my finger because this brush is not blending well. Yeah, this black kind of like mocha-ish color is not really blending in the best, so I had to start using my finger, which I mean is okay. And as soon as I said that these pigments were really good, yeah, this pigment is a little bit harder than um, the rest of them that we use. And I'm trying to blend as much as possible in so that you guys can actually see the look. Okay, so you can kind of see it, but I'm definitely going to add some shimmer into it. So this is what mine looks like so far. There it goes. Right there, you can kind of see the blokey. Um, Smoky. Smoky. <laughs> This is, don't look at that one. This is my eye. It looks like I got punched in the face. It doesn't, it doesn't really blend in that well. I'm going, yeah, I'm gonna give this one a five out of 10. I love the shimmer, but it's just too hard to blend in and it does not really look good. So I'm gonna try to save this eye. I'm gonna rate this one like a three out of 10. What'd you rate it? Uh, like a two or five out of 10. What did you rate it? Oh, I rated it 4 out of 10. 
Well, I'm gonna rate this one a three out of 10 because the shimmer is really bad and even while using my finger, I still got a lot on my finger, but hardly any blended onto the brush. Okay, guys. I mean, so onto my eye, so now I'm gonna one choose the next I'm one. I'm gonna choose is a little bit more blended. So let's show you guys. I need to turn around. So I'm using this. So you like it, guys. Messing with my cans. Sorry. Okay, guys. So you're ready to see what we chose, guys? Yeah. We chose. Okay. Okay. So let's see how this went out. We're gonna get a little bit more because it's probably gonna deserve shimmer. Make sure to tell them what brush you're using. Oh, I'm using this like um, lash one that actually has to use for your eye. I think I'm gonna go in with sort of like a brush like Nyla's. It's more like a. I'm not sure what this one is called, but we're just gonna get some. This is like a very light shimmer. And we're gonna put this on the brow bone. I'm gonna actually kind of blend it in with our black and it's probably gonna take over mainly. So I'm going to get out this brush. We're just gonna kind of scrape it out a little. strong pigment which I'm not mad that it's strong okay now let me mix it up I'm gonna blend it with my finger a little bit this one's taking a little bit longer just because I wasn't expecting it for it to be that strong of a pigment it's so like I added way too much and when you only really need a little. I'm gonna try to straighten it out with my kind of blue one a bit. Oh, <laughs> this is just look, looking like a smoky eye over there, guys. Pretty sure you guys cannot see her. And now I'm gonna go back in with that black, like Nyla. I'm trying to get some of the black to blend in with the silver. I mean, with the pink. This pigment is so strong. Okay, guys, so I think I am done with that. I don't want to mess with that anymore. So this is what the eye is looking like. As you can see, it's really strong. And I like how it's strong, but I feel like it's too strong. So I think I'm going to go with a 5 out of 10 for this Pigment. We're gonna wait for now to go ahead and wrap up with this color so that we can move into the final color. So this is what my eye look like. Don't look at this one. It's kind of like a smoky eye-ish. 